Well, hello there. My name is Sarah and I make plus size fashion videos here on my channel. I also have a bunch of other lifestyle content, home decor, mommy videos, all the type of stuff, food, gift guides, I don't know, I got all of it. So if you are interested in any of that, I would love it if you stuck around and joined our little family. And if you haven't already followed me on TikTok and Instagram, you should do that. The links and information is all down below. But today's video is going to be a Valentine's Day try on haul. Some of these items are new, some of these aren't new, but these are just some fun ideas that I have for Valentine's Day outfits this year. Some a little bit more fancy, while others are a little bit more reserved and casual. Um, I love Valentine's Day. It's one of my very favorite holidays and regardless if I have been in a relationship or I've been by myself, I have always loved it. I've always found a way to enjoy it and have fun and find a way to love on myself and feel beautiful and girly and get all dolled up and just have a good time. And so I recommend whether you are in the stage of life of having a partner or not having a partner or wherever you are that you have a plan for Valentine's Day and you find something, even if it just takes five minutes or whatever, ha uh, find something on a way to like love yourself and maybe love someone else. Um, yeah, so I will have everything linked down below because some of the items all come from different places, um, but I haven't filmed a try on haul in a very long time and we're trying something new. I'm going to do a like live try on of the outfits so we will see how that goes hopefully you guys enjoy it and uh, please let me know if you like the new format and if you absolutely hate it let me know that too so i can try something new i'm just i'm trying new things this was not the day to do that because the weather is atrocious we're in the middle of like a terrible ice storm and it's dark and dreary but we may do we did it anyway so <laughs> without further ado let's get started in the try on haul and i hope you enjoy this all right, friends, so we're gonna try a different format um, than I normally do when I do my try on. So we're gonna try it like this in the moment, okay? So I'm also feeling filming horizontally, which I normally don't do. I normally do like a vertical side by side to see try on so you can see the full thing. We're gonna try this out. Tell me what you like, like which way you prefer. Anyway, the first little dress I have is this really pretty, like magenta, fuchsia y velvet number. Um, it has like a cowl neck top um, and then the straps are tied so it's kind of like adjustable and you can lower it or raise it to fit your knees anyway um, it just goes straight down but then it goes into like a nice little a line um, like kind of slant you can see that and it's so pretty it's so comfortable it's super super soft it makes me think of um, my date with the president's daughter <laughs> but just like a grown-up version of it and just obviously like a darker color but it's just so pretty i love it it gives me like 90s vibes especially with the asymmetrical like hemline i think it would be so pretty for like a nice valentine's day date um i'm wearing a strapless bra it's a little bit too tight so you're gonna see like a sausage back action right now because it is holding me the heck in um and not looking the prettiest in the back but this is the back anyway I really like this. This is from Shein, and I believe this is in a 3X. There is a lot of like stretch and give to this, um, which I really like, especially if you're gonna go on a fancy little date night, and maybe you wanna eat a lot because it's Valentine's Day, and you want a good meal. And that way, you know, there's some room, you know? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> to grow and enjoy. So um, I really like this. Really pretty, a little bit more of a fancier date night option if you're going fancy. I've had this dress for over a year, but I didn't get to wear it last year because I think we got sick or something. I don't remember what happened last Valentine's Day, why we didn't get to celebrate it normally. Pretty sure somebody got sick, but I'm thinking I'm gonna wear it this year, but I got this from Shein and I just want to include it because I love it so much and it makes me so happy. And it's this white off the shoulder dress with red hearts all over it. It's just, ugh, I think it's so, 
pretty and just screams obviously Valentine's Day. I love Valentine's Day. I love when clothes look very obviously <laughs> meant for Valentine's Day. I like how like the little ruffle up here just kind of like all the hearts look like they're just like falling and scattering everywhere. I think that it's so flattering. It's really comfortable. It's perfect again for like a big meal because you got room, um, but it's still really pretty and ugh, I love it. I paired it with these little red heart earrings as well as this white belt that has this like pearl buckle. I've had all of this outfit for over a year now. This may be even longer. Um, and I really like it, but I'll have everything linked down below. I just, I couldn't resist sharing this with you because it's so pretty and I think I'm going to wear it this year. And I just, if you need something Valentine's Day, this is it. All right. The lighting is abysmal, just like the weather right now. So we are making do with what we got. But here is this next top it is so so pretty um it is like this really pretty peplum floral top from shein i love the sleeves they're like super dramatic kind of flare outwards and then like the floral pattern with like the hazy mesh overlay is so pretty i feel like this is such a beautiful date night top again perfect for like a good dinner because of the peplum kind of just whoosh you know what i'm saying and um it's really comfortable it gives valentine's day romance without being like in your face hearts everywhere if that's not your vibe um i think we are going away for the weekend or doing like some fun thing so this may be and this will be in the lineup um but i just really love it i think this is like a little bit more understated valentine's day look but still like dramatic and beautiful and romantic and i love it so comfortable cozy perfect for valentine's day this is in a 3x and has a lot of stretch and give to it i absolutely absolutely love this this next blouse is also from shein it's in a size 3x and it is another like floral like valentine's day vibed blouse without screaming valentine's this one's a little bit more drama though it is completely ruched all the way down the middle and then has these like big voluminous sleeves and shoulders the only issue is that it's a little bit too big so i just feel like it fits me a little bit awkwardly i think it's a really pretty blouse it's just not for me i think comparison between the, this one and the other one i like the other one more but i still think this is a really pretty shirt and i feel like it would look really pretty with like a like a faux leather black mini skirt and some like tall black boots with like chunky heels or even like skinny heels you know what i'm talking about like the 90s boots that i feel like are back i feel like that would look really cute together um with some jeans you know i feel like this again is like fun valentine's without being too much in your face but a little bit more dramatic a little bit more girly um i just think i like the other one better so I think I'm going to send this one back, keep the other one, but I still really like it. It's just, it's a little bit too big. So I wonder if I went down a size if I would like it a little bit more, but I like the other one enough to not try it. So still pretty though. Still would recommend if you're really into it, just like that one more. Here is the next little number. This one is so much fun. Now I know this is not for everyone. Not everyone likes a big bow, but if you are like, having engagement photos done or like it's supposed to be your birthday or you're expecting an engagement a proposal i feel like this is so much fun it's this really pretty like fuchsia again like a deeper fuchsia -y kind of red i don't know it's kind of hard to describe it's just oh like all the different sheen and shifts it take, picks up with the bottom half and then this fun big bow again i know it's not everybody's style and vibe but i just think it's so cute and so much fun um it is kind of a mini dress it's a little bit shorter but not too short but it kind of does flare out and kind of poof at the edges um you could easily put tights and some heels with this if it's just a little too cold like some matching bow heels i feel like would be so freaking cute anyway i love it adorable i don't know where i'm gonna wear it to but very 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 cute um and this one i think is also from shein i will have everything linked down as usual for you below to shop anything that you are interested in but like come on you got something fancy to go to this is like fancy cute like this is like a cute fancy whereas like the first dress the velvet one is like more of like a sexy fancy not that this can't be sexy either or that can't be cute but just you know little bow like you're the present 
I love it. So cute. So for those of you who are actually going to stay in on Valentine's Day and not go out, I have an option for you. So whether you're having like a slumber party with your bestie, partner, or by yourself, I found this really, really cute little set. This is actually from Walmart. It's from the Joy Spun collection. Um, and it's a little two-piece set. It comes with this little button down top and little ruffle trimmed shorts. So freaking cute. The shorts have pockets. Um, it's really, really soft, super comfortable. I will say that I feel like I tried on something Joy Spun during Christmas time and it was huge and I had to size down like two sizes. This runs not small maybe more true to size and i actually sized down on this one um because i thought it was gonna fit the way the other one did so i would definitely be wary because i feel like it's the sizing is kind of all over for joy spun but it's a great line i really like the items but just be aware of that so for this particular thing i would stay true to size this is totally fine like it's not too tight or anything i just i like my pajamas to be basically ginormous <laughs> so um this is probably how normal pajamas are supposed to fit, but in my head I'm like, I need like three sizes bigger, please. Um, however, still very cute, still very comfortable, really nice and soft. Now, if you live somewhere where it's like below zero, this may not be the option for you for Valentine's Day, but if you live somewhere in like a warmer climate, like this is really cute. I really like it. I'm happy. It has strawberries and champagne all over it. It just screams happy Valentine's Day. So for those of you staying in and looking for some fun and comfy PJs, these are your options. And it's only like $16.98 if it's a little two-piece set. Love it. Here's my last outfit. Um, one of these items I've had for a while, but I wanted to show it to you in its entirety because it's something that I'm wearing for my Galentine's Day night with my best friends. We are having a little slumber party. We just finished reading Book Lovers, and if you've never read it, it's fantastic. Highly recommend, but they have something called a Hepper Night, and they wear fancy robes and dress up like Katherine Hepburn and watch old movies and just enjoy themselves and that's what we're gonna do. So, um, I have this robe that I've had for a number of years now. I believe I got this from Forever 21. I need to steam it. <laughs> it is very wrinkly, but I just thought it's so pretty and it just makes me happy and feel so girly in Valentine's Day. Anyway, um, I have that. And then, first off, let me just quickly say, I don't have bra on, okay? I'm gonna say that right now. And there's a lot of you who've been leaving comments about my my lady things, you know what I'm saying up here, and getting real upset about it. So I'm just gonna clarify. I got boobs, you know? They're here, they've been here for a long time, and unfortunately, even for myself, they're not going anywhere. So if these offend you, this is probably not the channel for you. No problem, no like, harm done, you can just, you don't have to be here. But there's no reason to comment on them, you know? They're here, they're part of my body. I can't do anything about it, so there's that. Anyway, but I have this nightgown, I think it's so gosh darn pretty. It has this lace panel right here, and it's a cow neck, and the color, just like, ugh, it's so stunning. Anyway, um, it crisscrosses in the back, and it's a nice long, nightgown it goes like all the way well past my knees down to my shins and I just feel like it's so glamorous and just like very classic Hollywood like nightgown to me right like doesn't this just scream old Hollywood glamour it's just absolutely stunning so I'm gonna wear this little number because I just can't resist it's so pretty and then um I also have these shoes <laughs> I really wanted heels, but I decided to get these because I feel like they'll just be a little bit easier to wear, but I do plan on getting heels eventually. But some just like fun feather slides in white just give the old Hollywood glamour vibe, like totally completed, all done. It looks so pretty and I can't wait. So this is what I'm going to wear for my Valentine's Day night, but I wanted to share with you because I think this is like such a beautiful, like sexy nightgown, but also really comfortable and I like it. So want to share it off with you all right that is the end of the video thank you guys so much for watching i hope that you enjoyed it please let me know if you prefer this type of 
try on video um i have had different requests in the past to try different things and i'm just trying to figure out what works best for all of us so this definitely was something new for me it's not something i'm used to doing i don't know how i liked it but if you guys preferred it let me know um i hope i gave you some good ideas and don't forget if you are looking for any of the items they're down there for you um but for those of you who are going to celebrate valentine's day this year i hope that you have a wonderful day i hope that you feel loved and appreciated i love you and i'm so thankful that you're here and whether you are celebrating and having a hot date a night on the town with your significant other or you're hanging out with your best friends or you are staying at home and loving on yourself and doing some self-care i hope that it is a wonderful evening and that you feel loved and you feel good and you get the rest and enjoyment that you deserve um and i'm so thankful for you so i hope that you know that um thank you so much for watching and uh i'll see you guys in my next video bye guys